we're gonna go for the strip monster here because we're gonna be able to do a two shot here and finish it off with more stats we didn't get anything here but luckily we still got a tarot my, not tall rock, a table. This could be big, my boys, or this can be game breaking. So, you're gonna see it right now. What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, John and Dew, and I'm coming back at you with another Baseball Superstars 2022 video, my boys. My boys, it is official, my boys. We are back with the attack we don't lack and you know your boy is he's black isn't he he is <laughs> no he isn't isn't he a lame you think i thought he looked irish <laughs> all right my boys but seriously speaking we're back we're coming back um with some more episodes of baseball superstars 2022 but my boys what i want to bring to you and talk to you about and what we're going to actually do today so we're going to go ahead and run some zk um zk got a massive buff my boys massive buff and everyone should be taking advantage of playing zk and making the best characters you could possibly make i mean it's insane right now um with the stats you get from ZK. Before we actually go into it and make a player, I'll just show you um, my left fielder. I haven't did right fielder yet. I'm waiting for the contest to start before I do right fielder. And then I will have to move my, my player classic to another position once I do make a right fielder. So I've just been lazy. I haven't did right fielder yet. But I have did left fielder. And so far... Damn! This is my best left fielder. I've made plenty of MM3s. I made MM2s. I made a lot of MMM left fielder fodder. But, like, if you look at this, like, look at the freaking sub stats, my boys. Like, this is like freaking making a, a My Player Classic. So, you, you basically in ZK are making My Player Classics in here. Like, the stats are so freaking insane, my boys. Like, there is no way to be imbalanced and ZK. All right, my boys, real quick, we're just gonna do another left fielder, just to show you the ropes. Okay, now, four trainers, it can go either or, but here's what I like for left fielder. For left fielder, you don't really have to use so young if you don't want, I like using her, so I'm gonna use her. Um, if you wanted to, if you wanted to use like silver balls, you could try to get an re extra resolve from Knox or extra resolve from Scumbag Joe, and then you'll have uh, your five left fielder resolve there and then if you wanted to you could put in monkey king you could put in hell and you can do whatever you want from that point uh monkey king you you like on my left fielder deck i don't run them but i'll show you my right fielder deck because if this is what i'm going to do for my right fielder deck i'm going to run them i am going to run monkey king on my right fielder deck and you see i don't have a max and even with him not being max i'll still be able to get a uh, triple m5 because zk is that op right now for left fielder, I love this deck. And then I'll explain why. Chell and Scumbag Joe has training reward all. So that training reward all is actually gonna boost so young if they actually if they ever land on mental. So it's like I have three mental trainers and I have five deck trainers to what it what it basically makes it. So it's they can still help her. And I just love this deck. So we're gonna go ahead and run it and I'm gonna show you how to play ZK with six trainers of course this is six zk trainers four items my boys i will always suggest tar tara is a must not like, no matter what you're running you have to run tara it gives you three extra events you need those three extra zk events period no matter what you have to run that item now whether you want to run perfume whether you want to run table that's up to you i suggest table because you can even go even further like if you get a bad training and you have a mental guy you want to take down you can sort of reshuffle and maybe you'll get a uh, big enough to one shot that mental guy and it's very important the five versus the six the six not so important but the five is very important so but my items i would run would be table 
and Tara. All right, my boy. So we are running ZK. Now, the first thing you want to do, and this is the uh, absolute must, you want to avoid Specky at all costs. <laughs> you want to avoid Specky at all costs. <laughs> so this first week is strictly about avoiding Specky. That's that's what the first week is about. You're just like, hey, please, no Specky. No Specky, no Specky. That's all you're looking for. So right here, it sucks. We don't got him on the decks. We don't even got him anywhere. First week, avoiding Specky and trying to get Affinity built up. Like, I would like to get Dex facilities up as well if I can, but it's not my main concern. Like, I really want to make sure that I'm picking the trainings with the most guys on it. Try to get my Affinity up as fast as possible. So in week two, three, and, and beyond, we could be getting better chances at special trainings. Okay. Now you want to avoid Specky at all costs. Since we got one on the decks, I'm going to take it over to two infinity. And once again, we're looking to avoid Specky at all costs. We haven't got Specky yet. And week one, if you get Specky, go ahead and delete that run. Be honest, the trainings are very bad because of we're not getting stacks. Even if it was two, like three on the end or three on the mental or anywhere, I would be happy with that. So since we're not getting that, I'm going to still try to aim at getting the dex facilities up. And as you guys are saying, all these cores are not super boosted. So when I made the, the triple R4, none of my cores wasn't even super boosted to this point. So that's just something to think about. Like, oh man, these trainings are bad. They just been all over the place. If you look, my boys. Okay, so we're going to go for the dicks again. Very bad week one. We avoided Specky, but... As you saw, we just we didn't get any affinity from that basically. No affinity at all. Okay. And then from here we're just gonna skip the games. We're not gonna worry about the games. Choose wisely. Have you set up your goals yet? Alright, my boys, if I had to predict on this one as well, or what we're going to get, it's probably going to be somewhere around uh, Triple M2 or above. That's norm that's normally what my ZK runs are. I haven't been getting anything really less than, than that. Like, you know, maybe uh, Triple M if it's really bad. So, okay, so we got Mental here. Mental is what you want to get. And the reason why you want to get Mental is because of, that's what you're going to do the most damage against since you have Dex Trainers. So mental is what you're going to aim for. So right here, we got mental. But look, the trainings are so bad, my boys. We wouldn't even one-shot it. Uh, I will ha I'm going to hate to do this early, but for only for training purposes, I'm going to try to show you this. Okay, so we got a special training on decks, which is what we want. So now we're going to one-shot it. So as you see, because of aura is lit and giving us a special training, and we got three ZK trainers, we're actually doing a lot more damage on here. Even the mental right here should be, is, is a lot of damage as well. So we're going to go ahead and take down this trainer. Oh, my fault, this monster. And one shot, like we want to do. And then we're going to get another monster after this. Now, because we still got two trainers with cores, what we're going to do is we're actually going to select this one. Because uh, this is not going to do anything since this is not an actual event. When we get down to the events, the trainers will start doing 300 damage a piece. So with that 300 damage they do, you're going to want to try to select something that you can take them out as well. My boys, I am so disappointed that this run is this bad. I'm, I'm, I'm very disappointed, my boys. Like, it's really bad.
Let's do it one more time and see. Hope we can get the one shot, my boys. It's it's just been really bad, as you see. Um. Yes. All right, that gives us the one shot. I don't know why it's been this bad. Like this is like super bad. They not own decks at all, my boys. Okay, so right here, as you see, we got monsters with 300. What we'll do is we'll take one of those. And I'm going to probably use a Tarot to show y'all for training purposes again. Because this was a regular event that's not going to actually give us an attack. And we got two on the decks there. So we definitely want to save that if we can. Okay, so if we use the Tarot right here and this is not what i'm suggesting to do this is i'm showing you at this point so if we would have did a regular attack we would have got a normal event then it would have basically did 300 damage as you see right here with that 300 damage that's not going to one shot that monster so now we got the ice queen which is what we want we got two on the decks, so that means they're going to do more damage to her as well. Now, if we get a 500 or above, we can one-shot this son of a bitch. So we're going to see if we can get a 500 or above. We might not. Most likely, we're not. But we may. And if we do, we're going to basically hit her with 500 there. And then the event's going to do another 300, killing that son of a bitch. But we'll see. We didn't do 500, so it's going to take three shots, unfortunately. But the good thing about running it with six trainers, it's really not that important on that part. We're just gonna speed this up. We're not gonna do that. Um, my boys, like they are in terrible spots. This is a bad run. I will tell you that right now. We have the momentum now. Okay, so we took out the Ice Queen. Three, three shots. And what I will say, when you're running this with the actual uh, trainers we're running it with, you're going to want... Um, uh, okay, so what I want to say is when you are running this with six ZK trainers, you are always going to want to take the stats if they give it to you. Okay, we got the facilities leveled up. All right, we're going to hope that we can get a better run going forward from here. Doesn't look that way, but we'll see. Okay, so right here, we didn't get what we wanted. We're just going to take something. It's going to one-shot it with the event. We definitely always want to get those stat monsters if we can. That's just going to be extra stats that help you out. This will give us extra experience, which is important in the five run, but not so important in the six run. So right here, we're going to still go for the lava monster because he he brings the stats so yon can help us with mint if she's there so we're not going to one shot this guy so we might as well just go ahead and take the decks the mental unfortunately if she was lit that that would be a one shot but we don't have that yes. all right and even with it taking two shots, because we're getting the stats, it's definitely worth it in the long run. You know, the only thing we're aiming at for experience wise is getting to level 13. We're not aiming for anything else. You know, getting past 13 doesn't do anything for you. So we just aiming at getting 13, but we want to also get as many of them stat marches that we as we as many stat marches as possible while we're going. So right here. These trainings, man, they are just not the best. 
And the reason why I say that, as you see, like, he wasn't lit. It was only, it was only Kinsley being lit. Okay. All right, my boys. For this, we're gonna need a hell of a roll. As you see, we we can finish them off. Will we get that roll? Possibly not. With how this one is going as well, so we didn't even get the roll. Oh, we did get the roll. So we finished them off in three shots. Now we're back to this. Now what we're gonna do is, since we got an event coming up, my boys, we're gonna take the three hundred one. 300 one's gonna be a one shot. We're gonna get those stats and experience, my boys. I should have chose the other one. Okay, so as you saw right there, one shot. Now, and that's how you basically want to try to do it. Right here, we don't got crap. We're gonna see our next our next row once we finish the game. And then we'll determine if that's worth it um, to do a reroll. A well deserved win. The player. I want to see something better next time. Got it? Okay, so we didn't get the facilities upgrade. So it's bad, Rose, my boys. We're gonna go with the mental for so young. I'm gonna just chant it and hope we get the actual, um, 250 or above we might not Just like how we train. so we did get it and be honest my boys this run is, is clearly in the dumpster at this point okay so we got these again we're hoping we get stats instead of those but I mean what are you gonna do if you're getting those like especially when it's when it's in the between an event just sort of got to take them but we are gonna get one shots and that makes us get to the boss faster no, in a five event, that's fine. With six trainers, you definitely want to try to get more than just that. Okay, so we got two on the decks here, which is good. One of these scumbags to start showing up. Okay, two more on the decks here with the girl so young. Go ahead, do that warm up, get them stats up. All right, we would need a big hit here. We might just get it, my boys. It's possible. We got a better chance of getting 457 than we don't. So let's see what happens. All right, my boys, there we go. Take them down. Hopefully we get like the Ant Monster or something. I don't think we got the Ant Monster yet. Ant Monster will give us an, some more stats and 300. Uh, still didn't get them. So I guess we'll go for it a little bit more gold and skill points. All 
All right, my boys. Now, you're going to have spare stats. So, with those spare stats, you definitely... Uh, <laughs> not spare stats, my boys. My mistake. You're going to have spare gold and spare skill points. That's the nature of this one. So, it, you can always go and get that party, that private party room. Don't be afraid to get it. You're going to have the, the extra stuff to get it. So... In my case, I always like to go with Chow and Shou Young. If you got them, definitely go with them because of not only for the costume, because they add an extra 20% to your training. And then we're also gonna choose your girl Aura because she has a costume as well. What you do though as well, go ahead and get that training reward for two. And condition controller. Because of you're gonna need it no matter what in this one. I'll buy mine with skill points because of I know I'm gonna have spare skill points too if this is a great run. If not, then hey, I'm just going to the dumpster anyway, right? Okay, so week five is approaching. We got our level three dex facilities. With ZK, if you do have Kinsley gold, it's gonna be so tremendous that you're not gonna to have to worry about gold. Now, I don't know how the run deals without her, but I know the runs with her, you have a ton of gold, so. I could possibly try to reroll that, see if we get a monster. You know, uh, we're not gonna worry about it. Normally, with, with one like this, I may try to reroll it to get a better monster, but we'll just keep it moving and maybe save those and See what happens later. I, counted on you. I also could have used the tar rod to take him down and, and see, but I'm gonna wait and just see what, what happens from here. Let's take the strength one. Let's get a little bit of strength. Okay, so we got our girl so young, which is good. She's the second best to health. All right, it's gonna be damage right there. Then we're gonna go ahead and finish him off right here. level nine now so we're, we're approaching okay so right here we sort of got got screwed because an event comes next so I'm gonna have to finish off that monster instead of re-rolling him go ahead and buy the glove now All right, we might be able to finish him off right here. We'll see, my boys. We need a high roll. That's, that's and we didn't get it. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and take the Dex Monster right here. And as you guys see, we're just aiming for them stats. We're just trying to get as much stats as we can. We got a big training here, so we can go ahead and take the, uh, go ahead and use one of our, our boost. Now we might not get the actual 375. Um, it's a chance, you know, we're, we might get it, we might not. So we're just gonna roll and see. 
Hopefully we get it. And we did not get it, so we don't get the one shot. We've been in a lot of bad roads, my boys. But the good thing is we got six trainers. So even with six trainers, even with the bad roads, we're definitely going to be able to, to finish them off. I'm still not afraid about getting to level 13. So, and that's the good thing about running ZK with the with six ZK trainers, you know. You're going to make it to level 13. You don't have to be afraid of that. You know, take chances. Try to get as much stats as you can while, while going through the journey of level 13. Okay. Some things to note. Scumbag Joe hasn't shown up at all here. So, we're going to see if we can get his affinity to max so we can possibly get the other support skill. If not, I'm fine with, with not getting it to max as well. So... See, right here, the training isn't that good or whatever. So, I'm going to go ahead and, and take this. We still will two-shot this guy. But I want to try to at least get him some infinity. Like, because he's not maxed. I want to get the support skill as possible. So, in the trainings that's not that big or anything, then we'll go ahead and, and, and do a little self-sabotage in there. Okay, see, so now he just went away. You know what I mean? So we're two trainers away and we just, so we changed how bad that was right there, which is good. Okay. So me, I always go for, I always go for this guy. So if I get him, he shows up, he's, he's getting damaged, like period. We're going to see if we can take him down in one shot. We got another triple here, my boys. This will take him down in one shot, but I'm not going to pass up that triple, my boy. So we're going to go ahead and take that triple. Welcome. We'll take him down in two shots. That's fine, my boys. Definitely will not pass on a triple like that. All right, that finishes our super skill. With that finishing our super skill, I'm probably going to play the next two games because, uh, oh my, the batting performance has been trash, my boys. It's been trash. Another thing to note, we still got our Taurot, so... All right, we're going to go with that Ice Queen, Ice Queen again. Try to take her down as fast as possible. You are a dependable player. Okay, now I'm hoping somewhere we still see Scumbag, which we see him right there. So that means we only, we just one training away from getting his affinity. Meaning I can do a little self-sabotage and make sure I get that. And there he goes, showing up right there at the end. Now what I'm, you know what, we'll save the Taurop. We'll go ahead, max him. Okay, so we're gonna one shot this guy next. And we are well on our way to 113. We are well on our way to level 13, my boys. Level 13 is going to happen no matter what. Nothing can stop level 13 from happening at this point. All right, there is the spider. He finally shows up. Very, very late. So we won't even wait. We'll just use this tar rot and take him out right here. Uh, I can't remember what does what. I think keeping it a secret do something to your mood can't remember okay so we took him out in one shot so right here we'll take her again and we'll see what happens next round my boys but we are looking good for getting level 13 as you see we still got a ton of gold as I was saying we got enough gold to buy our gear in by lectors already you know, just for the sake of it, let's just go ahead and buy lectures now. 
see what it ends up being if we pass or fail this lectures lectures loves to fail me so let's see if he's gonna fail me for the youtube come on fail this lecture for the youtube show him the true lecture oh man he see he's showing out he's showing out because he know this is for the youtube i never get past lectures all right my boys this is the final week once again, we want to hit level 13. We are on our way. We already got our max lectures as well, as you guys saw. Well, not max lectures, but we got our past lectures, so we don't have to worry about that either. So we got one. It's possible to get a one shot here. We're going to see. It's not the best training, but we didn't get the one shot. Okay, so my boys, if we can get another triple here or quad or something like that, then, you know, who knows? This could actually turn around to be a good run, my boy. So we're going to see if that happens. Nothing truly amazing on either or. We can't do 500 damage or anything, so I'm actually just going to go for the mental... It was going to take three shots to kill this person, no matter what. We're going to offer help, go for the gamble. Okay, next one, we're going to take this person down. Let's take them down with the Tarot. Let's finish them off right here with the Tarot. Then we'll see if we can do a little bit more damage on something that's strength or something. Let's go hell mode, my boys. We failed the hell mode, my boys. Okay. So one more monster would get us level 13. We didn't get anything good. We got more stats here. So we're definitely going to take the two shot on the stats. Just in case, my boys, I'll buy Condition Controller. We got all the extra gold in the world. And I mean Danger Detector, not Condition Controller. So we're going to buy that and see. You are a dependable player. Okay. And this right here will put us at level 13, my boys. Like I said, and you see how easy that was. I was not worried about getting level 13 the whole time. We're going to go for the script monster here because we're going to be able to do a two shot here and finish it off with more stats. We didn't get anything here, but luckily we still got a Tarot. Not, not Tarot, a table. This could be big, my boys, or this can be game breaking. So you're going to see it right now. Nothing big, my boys. Nothing big at all. We do got the possibility for a one-shot as well. We'll take it and see. I doubt we get it. Even if we did get it, it doesn't help us with anything because uh, the experience won't help us. Um, so nothing really helps us. And we got a danger detector. We really needed another triple, my boys. We got another triple. We could have been looking at, at something big, my boys. But didn't happen. Maybe next run. So we missed that by 20. Would it not matter because of with this event, it would have never did enough if we got another special monster anyway. Like there was no 300 monsters left that was going to give us stats. So we end up taking him down for the extra strength at the end. And once again, my boys, like, and you see, like these guys don't do anything. And that's why you don't want to aim for them. You want to aim for the one guys with the stats. 
so you can have more stats as you go on so as we see right here you know right now we still don't have the boots and we still got a ton of stats my boys a ton of stats okay so we're gonna play the last game as well and see what happens so all right my boys i'm gonna let them finish this calculation of everything All right, we didn't get the boots. Luckily, we have tons of gold, so we can go up here and buy special stand. And go ahead and get the aura boots, my boys. All right. Let's go ahead and get these skills added. And as you guys see once again, we have tons and tons of skill points um, with ZK. If you if you're running it with Monkey King as well, you even have even more where it's like there's such a massive amount. Um, as you see, I wasn't even I didn't even have Monkey King in. Look at what we're remaining with, my boy. 700 extra skill points. Absolutely nothing to do with. 3,000 extra gold. You know, uh, running ZK is very, very nice. You know, it's one of the easiest, most chill scenarios you can possibly run right now. As you see right there, wasn't even a, a best run. We're going to see what we get. If we would have got another triple or a quad at the end, it could have made this run something really beautiful. But we didn't get it. But we're gonna see what we what we got anyway. All right, my boys. As I predicted, MMM two wasn't even a great run, my boys. You guys saw that. Y'all saw how none good that run was wasn't anything amazing still made a triple m2 not doing anything really um with zk it's it's one of the best ones you can run and that's how i run it with six trainers you know just aim for the stats really and that's going to get you the best bang for your buck in zk uh, when you're running with five trainers you want to aim for the experience a lot more than you do with the stats because you want to make sure you reach level 13 to get all those extra stats and we'll actually do another run with five trainers my boys so it will be coming to you this won't be the only one but with that said my boys that's going to be it for today's video we are back once again you guys have a good one make sure y'all stay safe out there Peace, my boys.